Uh, it's that sad time of the year for those of you that have freezing temperatures in the states. Time to winterize the boat. So what we have to do is a quick and simple winterization process that involves antifreeze and we recommend the biodegradable or the environmentally friendly version. We need some buckets. Now this bucket is designed to feed the antifreeze into the engine as the engine runs. We're going to dump the antifreeze into this bucket and start the engine so we minimize the amount of waste that we're going to have to recycle. All of our reclaimed antifreeze will be recycled at a proper recycling uh, area. When we dewinterize the boat, the same process, or I should say the opposite process, will follow where you're going to have to take the antifreeze and we recommend you replace it back in the bottles and mark it for recycling. So recycle all your, all of your antifreeze to help protect the environment. Once you have everything set up, we're going to dump the antifreeze in this bucket. It's going to be fed in as the engine runs. And then in the pool that we have, it's going to collect all of the residual antifreeze that comes out. Once it turns green, in this case, it might be pink depending upon the color of antifreeze, you will be able to shut your engine off and the interior of the engine will be winterized. All right, so we've got our bucket of antifreeze ready to go. We have this bucket is going to be dumped into this bucket, which will then flow into the engine. Once the bucket is poured, Nick's going to give me the sign, start the engine, and I'll start the engine. And prior to this whole winterization process, the recommendation here is to have your engine running using fresh water run it for 10 to 15 minutes make sure your uh, gas has been stabilized with uh, products to stabilize the gas for winter storage and then you'll be ready to winterize the engine by pouring this antifreeze in let me put the blower on now the blower's on making sure that any potential gas fumes are out blower should be running for at least four minutes prior to starting all right nick We've got our four minutes done. When you dump it, tell me when. Tell me to start it, okay? Now, in a few moments, you're going to see the engine start to steam. All right, so the flow is coming in from the antifreeze bucket. It's being pulled in by the impeller. The impeller is what's responsible for cooling the entire engine. It pulls fresh water in, and it circulates it throughout the engine, cooling the engine. Okay, the antifreeze is almost in. The water is now turning green. It is now time to say we have a complete circulation of antifreeze throughout the engine and it is now okay to shut it down. Nick, just lean this over and uh, tell me when it's uh, all been sucked through. Now please, for the environment's sake, we're going to recycle all of this water and antifreeze that has mixed in here. When we dewinterize, get it ready for next season, we're going to do the same process except we're just going to be pumping fresh water in to circulate through the engine which will in turn clean out any of the antifreeze that's been put into the engine. Again, we recommend that you use the environmentally friendly type antifreeze. All right, for the cleanup process, we're going to remove the quick connect and let whatever fluids drain back down into the pool. We're going to drain our bucket of antifreeze back into the pool. Again, this will all be recycled. Again, you have some old towels laying around. This is what they come in handy for. Cleaning up the residual antifreeze or anything that it might have leaked out. Okay, the final step. What has now been recovered in this pool will now be taken to a recycling center in the properly marked containers. There's always plenty of recycling containers around. So antifreeze, just identify it as antifreeze and place them in a secure area to be recycled.
So the final step is to store all of your recycled antifreeze properly and out of the reach of any young children until it is time to take it to the proper recycling center. When you recycle your antifreeze, if you notice the color is similar to the original color, you can purchase a coolant tester from your local auto parts store and test it to see that you may be able to use it the following year for winterizing your boat.